Okay, hello, this is Dr. Janes, and today I'm going to talk about how to fix this window problem that happens quite a bit to me and probably happens to other people. It's kind of annoying. Uh, this is Caden Live, and um, you have these different uh, things in these windows, and there's tabs here, and sometimes if you like click on it and you grab it in the wrong spot, what it does is it pulls the window out and uh, Where did it go? So it will pull the window out, and then it's so annoying because then you try to stick it in, and it might stick it in the wrong spot or something like that. And I guess you can rearrange the windows if you want, but see, it wants to stick it everywhere but where you want to go. You can even stick it over here if you want. But so if you if you get the window centered exactly right where it was before, see how there's only two tabs there now, and then this window is smaller, or that window is smaller, and I guess you can change the size of these if you want, but I kind of like it the way it was originally set up. So you can click up here and grab and pull if you get it centered right in the middle of that window. See so if you could go like that, it'll stick it above it. That's so annoying. So if you get it right back there, it goes back into the uh, place where it was before so you can have all your windows under the same tab. So I, I mean, I guess if you want to rearrange things, then it's a good way to do it. You can, you can do that type of thing with this window as well. Pull it out and uh, it's kind of annoying not to have it there because uh, or I guess you could even pull it out and make it bigger if you wanted. Just make it separate and make it really big. If you want to see it, whatever. But oops, where'd it go? I guess it went back. Did it go back? No. But the annoying thing is, is that if you uh, don't put it back to where it was, and you close down Caden and you open it back up, it will remember that you had that thing out, and it will just put it back to where it was before. Okay, so let's stick this guy back in there if we can. Okay, so he's back in there. You can do the same thing with this, these guys. And I like to keep this on Project Monitor because Project Monitor monitors what you're doing down here when you're sticking stuff together. Whereas if you put it on a Clip Monitor, that's just monitoring the clips that are over here. So you can look at the different clips when you're trying to stick them together. And uh, this is another great music video that I'm trying to put together. And I'm sure it'll be really good when it's done. Make lots of people really excited have a really good message. I like uh, spreading uh, messages of joy and cheer and uh, happiness and hope. So anyway, <clears throat> this is a uh, hope this helps you with Caden Live and uh, if uh, people are interested I'll keep on making more videos about the uh, helpful hints about this whenever I run into problems or issues or things that might help you out. I'll try to make a video of it because uh, it's a really great program. It's a free program. Uh, it's really powerful. I, I use this one in an open open shot, but this one is a lot more powerful. It does a whole slew of effects. So here's the effects list, and you do all sorts of great things. Transitions. Those are those are important too. Anyway, so this is a hopefully hopefully this helps you fix your window problem if you have a window problem with a. Kaden Live, and uh, this is Dr. Janes, and thanks for watching.